I didn't get the smite. Still think the fight is good though. I still have passive, so I'm not scared here. Hey, Lulu is here. I don't want to go in. Let me jump on this guy instead. Could be a good bait, could be an int. Let's find out. I have nothing to bonk. No AP Bruiser? No Conqueror? Uh, honestly, I went Aftershock because, like, Kalista, Zed. I don't feel like I'm going to have very long fights against him, but maybe it would have been better. Wait. Actually, do I do the pink thing? I think Zach could do the pink thing, no? Can we do it like this? I think you can. I like the idea of getting a pink. Maybe I can save one of my laners with my pink. I'm not as squishy as I look. I'm not as squishy as I look. I think he warded. Do I hit him with the pink? I think I hit him with the pink. Boom, bitch. Oh, he's fucking molding. Wait, he didn't give XP to, to Ziggs. He's molding. Look how mad this Ramos is. Look at him. Wait, where is he? I'm going to make fun of him. Where is he? I'm going to laugh at him. <laughs> he's molding. No, they're going to clear my pink. Defend my pink, brothers. Don't let it die. I got him good, though. It was worth it. It was worth- even if they get my pink, it was worth it. If Shen, if, if Shen takes taunt, you can actually take her flush with Ziggs, but... They win level 1 really hard, so... Wait, our Ziggs is AFK, though, so it's kind of awkward. Fucking caps. AFK'd on us. It was actually so free, by the way. It was so free, caps. We would've destroyed them level 1, we're so much stronger. I could've taken Q and actually just killed them both, by the way. I gotta get a lot of value there, but it's all good, it's all good. It was worth it just for the memes. Actually, mid in the FK, it was free. God damn it, caps. Can I do both of these? Is this low HP? I'm not sure actually. Oh, let's find out! I'll just focus the blue buff down. I'll smite it if need be. This way it's safer. Even though I don't I ideally don't do it that way and I get um I keep both of them alive. I'd rather uh, safe than die to my uh, blue and grump at level a minute two. That would be a bit disastrous, wouldn't it? I don't think they're gonna gang top, so I'll just play towards bot here. Zoramus have an opportunity mid. He could. We do have a ward mid though, but I don't think that ward's gonna save him from Ramus gank. Ramus is queuing around the corner. <laughs> Got a slush too. <laughs> I'm gonna do my camps. If Ramus goes for another gank, then so be it. I'll try to use the red buff, the tempo I have from red to. Contest crab, get level 4, and then maybe double crab him. Okay. I won't be able to contest the crab, it seems, but maybe I can counter going bot. Get something in return. Nope. I won't be able to contest this crab, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna farm this. I actually stuck around and looked for a gank, he didn't even farm. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna farm my camps here. Base, go topside, invade his raptors. I'll make sure my bot lane does get dough first, of course. But then I'll just... Go topside here. I'll put the points in W here because I like having the extra damage to clear. Yes, I mean, I see what's going on. That's what they want me to do about it. If he flays my jump, that's it for me. That's all she wrote. Just make sure that we don't get dove here. They're going to back off. I'm going to base. We saw him on ward, so I don't think he has a gank here. If he double crabs me, it's fine because I have so many wards. I don't want to gank here. I have good base timing. 
Uh, he's gonna double crab me. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just run straight to his raptors and try to contest him. Because mid is in a lot of action here. So I'm gonna go to his raptors. If I can push him off his raptors and push him out of the jungle, I'm actually gonna be in a huge, hugely winning situation. Um, now, if he does his raptors right now, it's kind of unlucky though. But if I can manage to get that done, it would be huge. Okay. Ramas could most definitely be here. Uh, just want to contest his raptors here. Perfect. So instead of getting crabs, I got his raptors. Still pretty good for me. It's about the same as getting a camp. I don't think I can really gank mid here though, unless he goes in. I'll bring mid for these gank was essential for mid lane. Denying Zed the opportunity to all in is very important when you're playing. Uh, I need to path towards bot, so I'll go to Gromp, even though I'd rather do my Raptors here. He hasn't based yet, so I can even go for his uh, golems if I wanted to. If I was playing a champion that was more about counter jungling, I would consider that. But right now, I'm perfectly fine with what happened. Just gonna full clear my jungle again here. Warp towards my six, and life will be fine. Even though Ramos will be ahead of me. Um, towards six, I'm still happy with what happened. I got a gank off mid. Ziggs has TP right now still. Maybe he can help me terrorize the map a little bit. Why am I getting pinged here? Yes, I will full clear and then go bot. What do you think I'm doing? Hard for me to force a gank here, bot, isn't it? Can I force a gank here? I don't feel like... 3v3 we lose, so... I kind of don't want to force... I would really like to hit my 6 though, it's kind of huge for me. I'll hit 6 if I do Krogs, that's why I'm tempted to do that. I need to be mid here, I know it, fuck. I think he's fine though. Ram is not 6, so he's fine. I'm not interested here. Shane is pinging that he has ult, so I'm like hovering. But I wanted to go on the Z actually with uh, with Ziggs. Either way, not a big deal. I'm gonna do my golems and then go bot. I'm very close to six here. Oh shit, time to move. They're inting though, we have Shen. I missed. Get the XP off this. Get the XP. Caitlyn should have the kill. Four. I missed my uh, Q. So I didn't get anything, but that's fine. Still in a really good spot. Shen coming in clutch. It's the power of Shen. Sometimes people forget you exist. He loses a lot top, but that's okay. I want to just base here. They should look for a base as well. Gonna base on the same timing as my bot lane. Work towards top here. Alright, I'm gonna go full clear here, hand off blue. The Ziggs. He took cleanse actually. Not sure if I agree with that. Is he scared of getting ganked by Ramus? We're gonna wanna catch that mid wave and then come blue. I want to do the crab and then start full clearing. Right, just smite it so he can get back to mid faster. Because he's obviously losing some farm. He should die to me here. Oh, he dies one for one. Okay. I was just making sure that the guy dies for what he did. Cleanse the ignite off. I could do this uh, herald, but... Okay, I will do the Herald. Holy fuck, Ramos just slam dunked. I forgot that that does the ult. <laughs> Fucking slam dunk. Whoever thought was it, that was a good idea is genius, honestly. Like, Fucking Ramos slam dunking people. I can gank top after Herald here. 
I don't want to stop the Herald. I really don't want to stop this Herald. You're fine. Oh, I thought I will do more damage. Seems like she's dead. Hello. Mm, that guy's camps are up and I kind of want to steal them. E or W? I don't know. I feel like two points W should be enough to clear. I also have chem tank coming up soon. Should I go chem tank? I think I should. CDR is really nice on this champ. That's why I'm leaning towards chem tank. Oh, fuck. I'm stronger than him though. Night. He'll be able to one shot his turret pretty easily with Ziggs. What the? The thing here. Well, that turret will die eventually to Ziggs W. It's a matter of time, not a matter of anything else. I don't know why Zed didn't go on me. I mean, if Zed goes in on me and forces my blobs out, I think there's hope for them. But I want to. I'm gonna just farm up a bit here. He took my red. Well, I'm still level. I'm almost level eight. I'm just gonna grab this. Press B after I cover my bot lane here. But I really want this because it gives me the base or the gold I need for base. That's why I really want this camp. Because ideally, oh. Channel, it's not gonna be enough. Oh, it is going to be enough. Fuck, I don't think I can reach this guy. I have no jump. Flop. Oh, mid turret will die at some point. Ziggs just has to walk up and he's done. There we go. Yeah, this gives me my spike here. Bunch of CDR, which is always nice. CDR is pretty huge for Zack, in my opinion. Like, getting more W's out gives him a lot of damage. Having some CD on your E is really nice too. What is this? Why am I getting pinged so much? Do they want me to come bot? Yes, they do. I'll show up. I don't know if they're pinging that they're here or that they need help, but I'll go help. I didn't get the smite. Still think the fight is good though. I still have passive, so I'm not scared here. Hey, Lulu is here. I don't want to go in. Let me jump on this guy instead. <clears throat> Pretty good. Still have my passive, too. Just checking if there's anything juicy up here. If not, I'll just go do my own camps. If I hit this might it would have been great. I don't think I'm gonna greed here. I'm actually I'm not gonna greed for the for the wolves, but I will make sure that our bot lane and mid to get the slam these plates. Oh I fucked up. Oh I fucked up so bad actually. Oh, I inted so hard. Ah I, I, I don't know, I, I, I clicked out of my thing, I don't know why it went that way. No, this is bad. Oh, they're not helping me? Oh, yeah, they're not helping me. Why aren't they helping me? Why aren't they helping me? This is bad, man. I feel like we could have done something there if they helped me, but all good, all good. Still in a good spot, still in a good spot. Still very good in the game. Alright. I had passive still, so if they like bought some time for me and I can come out of my passive with ult and everything, I think I could just kill them all. But it was my pad, I fucked up my jump pretty badly. Kalista had ult still, but still. Pretty bad for me to fuck up my ult. I'm gonna go bot side here and get my camps. 
And ideally I do that. Uh, there's no plate, so Caitlyn should just take the wave and rotate to mid, in my opinion. I don't think she should stick around top and do, do some crazy stuff there. I think it's better if she just... Uh, moves away from top right now. Just rotates to mid, safe way. I finish my bot camps here. Go into top side after. I'll go through mid even. I can go into top side. The Zig's dead. And Shannon base. It's a good opportunity for me to get some farm here. I'm just gonna farm up a bit here. So on this next mid wave, the one that's right here, I'm gonna go ahead and include myself into the game through the mid wave. I'll just show up because we are playing through top, it seems. I did not get the memo. Oh, I can reach that. Or not. I got top there and... We w'd before he went up, he played as well. Team is not showing up, so it was just a bad fight to take. Caitlyn was hitting the turret. I'm gonna leave here. Actually, if Caitlyn rejoins, maybe it's interesting. That is here. Good night, friend. I'm trying to bonk this Ramus. Flashes damage here. I have no passive, so hard for me to bait. Need to wait until they use spells on someone else. Alright, fuck it. Good enough for me. He goes for me, he goes for me. I mean, right there, I just... Basically, the idea there is if he uses his spells on me, Caitlyn will finish him off. So, just try and get as much space as possible so he usually wastes his spells on me, and that's good enough. I'm gonna go ahead and tax this wave, because the wave is going to push towards them anyway. Um, so, it's better for me to get the farm than someone that gets scraps when they uh, end up here. I'm trying to think here, Omen or Spirit Visage? I kind of want both, to be honest. But which one first? Probably this first. Just grab some MR on the way out. Do it like so. And then I can maybe even just do Spirit Visage first and grab Omen after. Either way, as long as I jump around near the Caitlyn, life's going to be pretty good. So I'll do Drake after I finish my camps here. I want to reset the camp at least. Pretty easy for me to join from there. Managed to drag both of them. Just gonna make sure this guy dies first. That other guy will have a hard time running. Caitlyn collapsing as well. Make sure she can't kill anyone. Uh, Lulu's actually on the run still. I have a... Oh. I was gonna say I have a plant right here to reveal her, but Caitlyn's got her under control. Yeah, I'm just gonna go farm a bit more. Again, when you're playing solo queue, it's always good to keep farming. If you play fast and you fall behind because the plays go wrong, because you could have been farming instead, uh, you're probably going to end up in a position where the game is not as easy as it could have been. That's at least my experience. Right now, I prefer to just 
farm up here, get all my items. My team wants to fight and die, at least I'll have farmed. If I go join them and fight and die, it's pretty bad. Because again, Ziggs is not included in the play here, so I'd rather just play towards Ziggs. Make sure he's okay, and then on the next mid wave here... I mean, I think Caitlyn wants a base though. Either way. I can also do the opposite way, of course. Do it like this. That's why I can support Ziggs in pushing the deep wave top. With me here, it's obviously harder for them to make a pick. Okay, let's go here. Pink it, make sure there's no danger. I should have a sweeper, but since I have a trinket ward, I'll just use it. Let me drag the herald out. Oh, wait, it's too late. What am I doing? 20 minutes. Four waste. I'm not gonna pop my camp tank here. I think I popped it a little bit too early. The range is a little shorter than that. I can't kill him by myself, even though I have E. I'm dead. Somehow Zed found the kill on Caitlyn. No, I died. Barely. Alright. I'm pretty beefy, but if Caitlyn dies, it's pretty rough. They found an engage mid. I didn't expect they could with uh, Morgana's Black Shield. He went IE as well. I mean, we just need Caitlyn and Ziggs to kill the Callista, because obviously me and Chen can't. Also, I don't think Ziggs had much mana, because he didn't use spells when they were getting CC'd. And Caps ran out of mana in that fight. Ended up giving her a shot down to Callista. I think if I just jump on anyone's head, we win the fight as long as there's people behind me. Ideally, I disrupt Zed though. If I can stop, if I can jump on Zed and make him use his spells to run from me, I think it's a really big deal. Also, on Lulu, it's good. Oh, she might interrupt me. As I forget a sweeper again. Playing Zack without sweeper is pretty sad because you never know if people have vision of you or not. Okay, there's four people mid here, so we should go around. Zig is pushing out top deep. Doesn't seem like I'll get a good jump here. I have ping, but it's on Baron. I kind of like it there. Because if we fog into Baron, we can easily start it. out of my jump. Unlucky. Wow, oh, she walked on the fucking trap. So they're engaged. What oh, fuck? That's crazy. I got CC'd again. Jesus. My champ can't play the game. Oh. I chem tanked through a box to get there. No, no, let's just do that. It's free. He flashed my AP. Nice play by Shun though. Flashed my jump. Why does he want to do dragon? Is there something I'm missing? Dragon is nice and all, but uh, she's quite good too. 720. Ramos is pretty fast, he might actually make it here. Alright. Oh, that guy is pretty crazy though. Could be a good bait, could be an int. Let's find out. I have nothing to bonk. The 
blub, blub, blub. Dark's not balanced, actually. Well, it was a masterful bait by Karzi. <laughs> yeah, I think he lost all his HP hitting the Ramas. I don't know why he's building um, BT instead of... Actually, BT I guess is fine. I was thinking maybe it's better to go for uh, Lost Whisper to try and kill the Ramas, but honestly, I think BT is fine. It makes sense, this game. It's not just Ramas he has to worry about, it also gives him some lifesteal in case Ramas decides to kill him. I have items soon, so I'm gonna go finish farming here. It's a pretty big spike for me, so I'd like to grab it before the next fight. Playing off tempo, but such is life. Not on the not on the map at the same time as my team, but I'm pretty fast, so finally grab myself an elixir or an elixir uh, a sweeper, which means I can actually jump from some crazy angles. My passive is also up now, which is nice. How much does it give? Why does it get 5% extra from, from Revitalize, I guess? Okay, that makes sense. I can reach that guy. Does he die is the question, though. Wait. He let him go? Yeah, he's in there. We should Zed is an escape artist. I have to make sure this Ramos doesn't fuck us from the back. We don't talk about our Caitlyn now. One for one is pretty good. Lost a lot of HP though. I have a good flank here though. A very good flank. Oh, I was like confused as to what was happening in that fight, honestly. Ramas ran down Ziggs, I didn't expect Ramas to just roll out of the jungle and murder him, but it makes sense. I didn't keep track of where he was. And then look if I can find the Zed before he can find one of us. He has uh, Edge of Night and I don't have Smite for it, so... That's a nice play by him. I missed though. I wouldn't have had a follow-up anyway, it seems. Still their jungle, it's uh, always a good thing to do. Teammates don't want the jungle. I do though. No objectives are up, so this is the best thing I'm going to be able to take on the map. Just need to make sure I don't die here, and this is a very good thing to do. Enemy Ramus will never be able to catch up in levels to me. I think I should grab some anti healing here. Or some damage, like maybe I could grab Demonic Embrace or something, but I think Thorn Mail is always a pretty solid item. Especially with so much uh, lifesteal on that guy, on the Callista. I'm level 15, so I'm pretty huge to be honest. Very beefy, very, very beefy. No Lord Dominix, but Cyril does on Zed, so targeting him first is honestly necessary this game, because I don't think I'll die to Callista very fast. It'll take her a long time to kill me. They kind of need to reach backline. I would them away from my ult, so it's hard for me to reach, but seems like it'll work out just fine. I got the kill on her. That's the pull. And that's the dunk. Throw this guy down. Nice. Seems like that'll be it. That's all she wrote. Nice little Zack game to end it on. I mean, it was a big team diff, to be honest. But that's all she wrote. Alright, thank you all very much for watching. 
Thank you, Mayro, for all the gift subs again, and uh, for everyone else for subscribing. It's very kind of you guys. Uh, Dirtron, thank you for subscribing. And do I think Zach Top is still viable? Yeah, I think so. I think it's just uh, kind of hard. I think Caitlin carried here this game, so thanks to the LP. And uh, we'll see whether or not I make it through Masters tomorrow. Catch you guys later. Actually, before I go, let me see if I can host anyone. Maybe there's someone interesting to host. Share some of the love. Rat I mean, it would be funny. Let me see if there's anyone down on Karzy. You know what? He carried my ass, so he can have some of. I'm sure you guys will learn a thing or two by watching Karzy play. Wish him the best of luck in MSI, and thank you all for being here. Have a good one. Do, 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 do. Vipo for this epic raid. Thank you very much. Thank you, brother. Well played last game. Even though you could have passed it both more, more, more times. No. No. But thank you. Welcome everyone from Vipo's team. Nice, just don't feel the same. Oh. oh, oh.